Prepare yourself for a bone-chilling experience as you turn off the lights and immerse yourself in some of the best horror games on PC. Scary games will leave you feeling vulnerable and jumpy rather than empowered as you try and outrun and hide from your enemies. Even after you finish playing, the fear and tension of these horror games will stay with you. So today, I'm going to tell you about the 10 scariest horror games that will give you nightmares. For those who seek a spine-tingling thrill, these games are a must-try. But be warned, once you enter their world, you may never want to leave. Phobia St. Dinfna Hotel combines traditional action elements with psychological horror, creating a unique experience of tension and fear. The protagonist, Roberto, is a newly graduated journalist who visits Trees Atrilis to gather material for an article. During his stay at the St. Dinfna Hotel, Roberto investigates a mysterious sect that conducts human experiments in the name of unifying science and religion. The game boasts high-quality graphics and a realistic style that immerses players in a dark atmosphere created by the gloomy interior design and sparse lighting. Madison is an immersive first-person adventure game that delves into the realm of psychological horror. The game centers around the character of Luca, who wakes up in a dark room of a large mansion with blood on his hands. He soon realizes that he has fallen prey to the demonic entity Madison, who has compelled him to partake in a gruesome ritual that began ages ago. Although much of the gameplay occurs within the confines of the eerie mansion, the demon's tortures have a profound impact on Luca's mind, distorting his sense of reality and allowing him to move to other locations and to learn related stories. In Visage, the player is trapped in a gloomy household that has seen many horrific events spanning centuries. Murders and madness have become commonplace in the areas belonging to the mansion. The plot of the game is non-linear, and the course of the story is determined by the choices the player makes. Additionally, a large portion of the events are randomly generated, creating a unique experience for every playthrough. The gloomy atmosphere of the household adds to the overall sense of dread and suspense, creating an unforgettable experience. In The Beast Inside, players take on the role of Adam, a CIA analyst who, along with his wife Emma, moves to the country to work on breaking the code that could determine the outcome of the Cold War and enable the United States to win. The game is presented in a first-person perspective, allowing players to experience the action through the eyes of two characters, Adam and Nicholas. Through this dual perspective, players are able to gain insight into events that took place during different periods of time, as well as explore two distinct versions of the same locations. Given Given the game's horror theme, these locations are typically dimly lit and fraught with unsettling surprises. This action-packed adventure game draws strong inspiration from classic survival horror titles such as Resident Evil and Alone in the Dark. The setting of the game takes place in the fictional Winter Lake, where the game's protagonist, Caroline Walker, embarks on a mission to uncover the mysterious disappearance of her two sisters. To gather valuable information, Caroline sets her sights on Wildburger Mansion, a deserted residence converted into a hospital. However, things take a turn for the worse when she is attacked and rendered unconscious by an unknown assailant while searching the building for clues. Tormented Souls showcases meticulously crafted 3D graphics that pay great attention to intricate details in each location. The mansion's style is reminiscent of the iconic Resident Evil or its remastered version, adding to the game's chilling ambience. Remothered Tormented Father's storyline is shrouded in mystery, and even the main character remains an enigma. Rosemary Reed arrives at Dr. Felton's estate to look into the disappearance of his daughter Celeste, who vanished under mysterious circumstances years ago. The absence of status bars and interfaces in the game requires players to monitor the protagonist's physical state to gauge her condition. It is also worth adding that Rosemary learns new abilities throughout her journey and improves those she already has. LKA, the Italian studio behind the psychological thriller The Town of Light, brings us another gripping tale in Martha is Dead. The game is set in Tuscany during the height of the Axis and Allied conflict in 1944, though the war only serves as a backdrop to the central storyline. The plot revolves around the murder of Martha, the daughter of a German soldier whose defiled corpse is discovered one fateful day. To uncover the truth about this heinous crime, players must explore open and closed locations, manipulate elements of the environment, and decide for clues and puzzles. Through these actions, they can piece together the mystery surrounding Martha's death and bring her killer to justice. 
Layers of Fear is a first-person horror game that immerses players in a dark and psychedelic experience. The game incorporates themes of madness and classical painting, blending elements characteristic of classic horror movies. Playing as a 19th century painter, you aim to complete your masterpiece by exploring your manner for necessary items. But as the protagonist grapples with mental issues, your journey becomes a chaotic trek through the artist's tormented mind. Along the way, you uncover the history of the painter's family and gain insight into his troubled past. Observer is a first-person psychological horror. The game's story starts when the main hero receives a letter from his missing son, who turns out to be a high-ranking engineer working for Chiron Corporation. The protagonist picks up the investigation that takes him to the slums of Krakow and forces him to relive the dark memories and nightmares of both criminals and their victims. An important aspect of gameplay are sequences in which the protagonist hacks into the minds of suspects and becomes part of their nightmares, originating from their deepest fears. The Evil Within 2 is a follow-up to the highly successful survival horror game, The Evil Within. In this installment, players take on the role of Sebastian Castellanos, the protagonist from the first game, and a detective. The story centers around Castellanos' discovery that his daughter did not perish in the fire at their home, as previously thought. He embarks on a mission to find and save her, leading him to the charming town of Union. However, he soon discovers that the town is not as it seems and holds a gateway to an alternate reality. While the game still features the same intense and cramped environments as the original, The Evil Within 2 allows players to navigate through non-linear, open levels according to their preferences. This is my list of 10 horror games that will keep you up at night. If you have something to add, feel free to leave any comments here. If you liked this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel.